Streamers are disgusting human beings. Every day that passes, I actually think less and less of people whose first descriptor of themselves is streamer. I just know that they smell different and not in a good way. This is Pow Envy, a self-proclaimed Roblox streamer who lives in his own filth for views on TikTok. Now, usually with social media trends like this, there's a debate to be had about whether or not this type of content is one big joke, a meme, and that somehow makes this okay? It justifies it or makes it any better? How do I say this? No, it's not a bit. And this is disgusting, because even if this was some elaborate scheme to get famous on TikTok or pull more viewers on his stream, when he turns off the camera, he's sitting in a petri dish of Ebola. Like, what the fuck am I supposed to think? Ooh, you got me. That's a great joke. <laughs> you thought Asmongold was bad? Wait till you see Pow Envy. Cleaning my room because my mom made me. After she gave me some sass about my room being dirty, I decided I'd clean it up or she might kick me out. So I got some Vienna sausage and some ramen to snack on to give me nutrients. Got some of this trash out. That's an old enchilada. That is some ramen. And this is some salmon. This Coke, which I don't know why I didn't finish. I love Coke. Anyway, this sandwich was too hard on my teeth. My teeth are pretty soft. I have brittle teeth. So that was no good. Oops. Um, my roach trap is doing good. That little bean shaped thing is an egg sack. Every day we stray further from God. Did he just say egg sack holy fucking shit he has a roach trap yeah i mean that makes sense given all the food right i got most of the left side cleaned up looks good the right side i'm gonna have to clean up another time maybe tomorrow i don't know i'm just you know it's a lot of work so the desk is also i took a lot of the stuff off so we're looking good thanks for watching me clean my room guys i'll see you guys next time and uh stop calling my mom hot thanks i hate it i hate all of it this is what he does right he says, I gotta clean my room because my mom made me. And he just recycles the exact same format over and over again. Except he never actually cleans anything. And he just still continues to live in squalor. Straight depression. Straight filth. Dinosaur dung. Shrek's swamp. I don't know what else to call this. And this bug-eyed pencil neck freak is staring into my soul, bro. Okay? I can do without it. Cleaning underneath my bed as a Roblox streamer. Cleaning underneath my bed as a Roblox streamer. We had a roach infestation recently, and I found a roach underneath my bed. Oh, Got to you, little bugger. Shit, you later, dude. Me, dude. Anyway, my glue trap is nice and filled. Got a spider in it, too. I should have made him a pet. I forgot to do my homework, but luckily I use Pixolve. It helps me with all of my hardest problems, even the word ones in science and history. So water is the answer for that. Got, found some crackers on the floor, which is pretty cool. But the roach eggs kind of made it salty, which I didn't like. Why do I believe him? Why do I actually believe him? Chat, is this real? I don't even have a chat, but I'm asking you, is this real? I'm getting ready for my first ever date. Get ready with me, guys. After playing with my favorite little roach, I call her Maeve. She's Queen Maeve. No. She's also pregnant, too. No. So I'm taking good care of her, making don't. sure she's fed. Mm. Why? Moving on, I head over to my local Walgreens because I got to get me a new toothbrush. This thing was $70. I used my mom's credit card, but hopefully she won't even notice and I don't get in trouble. But it's like a lightsaber. Wow, wow. Isn't that- I fucking hate this kid. No, I fucking hate this kid. <laughs> Full stop. Everything about him. Hygiene's important, guys. I like to brush once a week because of how many chemicals it has, but I made an exception for this girl. And look what I found. I found another roach. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> There's fucking roaches everywhere. It's so much fun. They're like Pokemon. Also, I need a new creamer for my coffee that doesn't mold as quickly because it molds too fast. I can't save it for later and continue drinking it. So stick on my Velcro shoes oh. because tying laces is kind of hard. I never Not really the learned. Velcro. So I just use Velcro shoes. They're much easier. Of course and they you look do. Good. I can't wait to bring this girl home. I'm going to put her on that chair. We're going to play some League of Legends together. It's going to be so much fun. Wish me luck on my date, guys. How I stay young and healthy as a Roblox streamer. First, when I wake up, I kill any pesty roaches that were trying to eat my leftover dinner. That's so mean. But I got my pizza back. Oh! What's wrong with my car? Does anybody know? I think it's fine, though. I listen to Polo G. He's the goat. Grab me some <laughs> Marachan spicy ramen noodles. This really gets me going. I think the salt really helps maintain a salty diet, which is good for you. I eat two because one's just not enough. Boil the water, pour it in, and after three minutes, voila! It's good to go. Isn't that delicious? Then, I like to just put it down. I'll take it down later when I need to. Go fuck yourself.
Taking a shower as a Roblox streamer. A roach decided to die on my toothbrush, which was kind of rude, but a man does have to brush after all. Anyway, my roach infestation has somehow managed to reach the bathroom, so I gotta take this dead roach out of the tub before I can shower. I hate how comfortable he is touching these fucking things, bro. I read that sending them down the drain is bad for the environment, so I just flushed them instead. Anyway, starting up the bath, and I realize I forgot my homework. I have Pixolve to help me with all of my word problems. It makes it so much easier. Homework is a breeze when you have this app. We need to bring back bullying, and I am so serious. Yo, I have a question. Does anybody know how to get this dried conditioner off the wall? I like to use it to trap roaches. That way I don't have to squish them, but then they just sit there for a long time. But I'm clean now, so it's okay. I have never seen a more fried 21-year-old in my entire life. I think a 96-year-old with cancer on hospice has more health than this young man. It's Saturday shower day. That's right. It's time for the weekly shower, boys. Let's get it. First... What the fuck is that? What sort of creature crawled out of this man's bathtub? My closet's a little messy. I need to clean it up, but I'm a little too tired. It's really hard. My crunchy socks have been like protein for the roaches, I think. Your what has been what for the roaches? Enhance? My crunchy socks have been protein for the roaches. I'm gonna defenestrate myself. I'm going out the fucking window. Even after cleaning my whole room, yesterday I got stood up by a girl. Now, I even chased all the oh. roaches out of the room. This little guy was hard to catch, but I did get him eventually. I'm getting a flamethrower and burning down my entire house. You ruined your living space. There's no going back. It's over. GG. I cleaned up the entire floor, most of it. And it was basically just generic, typical mess that you'd see in a gamer's room. So it really wasn't that bad. It wasn't extreme. It wasn't pushed the limits. And I sent her pictures and she even seemed impressed with the cleaning. So I think what really threw her off might have been honestly got- Does this guy just go to 7-Eleven and just buy one of every chip and just fuck his shit up? Just pop all the bags? I can't figure it out. I think maybe it could have been like the desk just not being clean enough. I don't know what her standards were. I even showed her that. I was like, yo, I got a second chair. You can sit on this chair. We can play games together, play League of Legends. I showed her my rats. I think maybe she didn't like the rats, but they're in a cage. So what's the big deal? I showed her old pictures of me. It felt like we were really clicking. Um, I told her about the glow up I had. And I showed her my bed sheets because, you know, most people clean their bed sheets once a year. I actually clean my bed sheets every three months. I wouldn't even want this guy to get a nice mattress in this house. It would be a waste. But for those of you who don't live like degenerates, why don't you treat yourself? Which is why today's video is sponsored by Helix. They have great Cyber Week deals going on right now, so it's a perfect time to upgrade your mattress. Helix Sleep makes premium mattresses and bedding customized to fit your needs, conveniently shipped in a box right to your doorstep. You don't even have to leave your house. Everybody's different, and Helix knows that. That's why they designed a sleep quiz that helps match your unique body type with your sleeping preferences. This way, you can find the perfect mattress for you. If you sleep with a partner or even a pet, you can take the quiz together and find the best compromise for everyone. I like to sleep on my side and stomach, and I prefer a medium mattress feel, which is why I was matched with a Midnight Lux. I've been sleeping on Helix mattresses for over two years now, and ever since I moved, I had to upgrade from a queen to a king. That's how much I love my Helix. The days of going to a mattress store only to be sold an uncomfortable, overpriced mattress are over. In fact, your new Helix comes to you. I actually had fun setting up my new bed. It took me just under five minutes to carry it up the stairs and watch my new mattress spring to life. Best of all, every Helix comes with a 10-year warranty. They offer flexible payment plans and even have financing options available. So a great 
late night sleep is never that far away. I love my Helix, and I think you would too. If you're in the need for a new bed, check out Helix. They have great Cyber Week deals available now. It's the perfect time to upgrade your sleep with 25% off a Helix mattress, plus two free pillows. Click the link below or go to helixsleep.com slash Philion to find out more about this limited time offer. And thank you to Helix for sponsoring this video. <sighs> I just got a new pet roach. I'm not kidding, guys. I saw this little guy crawling on my desk, and at first I was gonna smush him, but I realized- That thing's, that thing's a fucking unit! <laughs> Holy shit, it's the hive mother! He was so cute. So what I had to do was catch him. First things first though, I kinda knocked over my monitor trying to catch him, and that caused me to spill some coffee. Uh oh, that doesn't look too good now, does it? Unfortunately, I don't have any carpet cleaner, so I'm probably just gonna have to live with it. Um. This is triggering like some insane OCD in me that I didn't know I had. Holy shit. Honestly, guys, it doesn't look that good. Looks like, you know, something bad happened, but it's okay. I have worse stains. But look at him. He's so cute. He is a guy based on my limited research. So let me know what I should name him. We'll be naming him in the next video, and I'm going to be getting him a cage and a proper setup. I want him to live his best life. I really think he's adorable. And I can't wait to grow and create a bond with him, really. I'm gonna end it. I'm gonna end it all. Eventually, I'll get brave enough to hold him. But you guys stay tuned for that one. I'm just a little too scared of him right now. But he's so cute, and I can't wait to play with him. I'm gonna teach him all sorts of tricks. I can't wait. Also, I know what you're thinking. He needs food. Don't worry. I put a peanut in there. I'll be putting some water in later. This guy is gonna live his best life as my new pet. Thanks for watching. See you next time. I think I'm going to cry. Taking my pet roach Albert out for a walk. Ever since I caught Albert crawling around in my room, me and him have just created this beautiful bond. So I got a shoelace from an old shoe, and I thought this will work. I tied it around the bottle that I keep him in, and now I've got a leash. Me and Albert are ready to go explore the world together. I've really gotten to know him on a personal level, and look at him. He's just so excited to go out. I love him so much. We went on a beautiful walk. I really imagine you and your family just go out for a nice stroll, a nice Sunday brisk walk, right? And you see this necromancer, this rotting pile of flesh and bones, walking his pet cockroach in a Starbucks Frappuccino ready to drink fucking beverage. I don't think I would ever go outside again. Cleaning my room because a girl's coming over. Guys, I've got a girl coming over and my room's got to be spotless when she gets here. I don't want to gross her out. Here's the room before. Like, we know all of this is staged, right? It's at least put here on purpose so that he could record these videos. But that doesn't take away from the fact that there is rotting food in this man's room. It is attracting bugs, swarms, hives. This is the situation outlook. I think it's gotten pretty bad. Um, but we're going to get this fixed up real quick. Those crunchy socks down there between my dresser and the bed. Have no, I'm just killing my kid. Full stop. I'm not even being ironic. I am choking the life out of my child. Yeah, so just how viral is Pow Envy going on TikTok? Well, this video has 2.1 million likes, 120,000 bookmarks, 50,000 shares, and 40,000 comments. Cleaning my room as a Roblox streamer. Again. First, I went over what we have. We have a roach infestation. I don't think it's caused by me. I think it's just a really invasive... We've got some bowls we have to clean up. This is why I hate this. Because he's self-aware, but since we're living in post-meme fucking internet, it's like never acknowledging the bit, right? Because he had to have put this food in here, and he has the self-awareness to film himself and bait for viral clips. It's infuriating. I don't know how to fight this. I, I admit defeat. Um, found this hot dog. <laughs> July 4th. All right, we cleaned up this chair. Get some of these bowls down. That's a little crusted on. Might need to soak it in some hot water first. We have some frappuccinos. Looks like something tried- Look at these mushrooms! Something tried growing in here. Not on my watch. Not on my watch. Now we got some snack trays. Gotta clean these up. Don't want my dog to eat them. I think he already did. Some Not the missing. super sod, bro. Found a little baby roach trying to get away. Sorry, honey. Didn't mean to leave that down there. He has a girlfriend? You can ignore 90% of being an adult, just, you know, skip hygiene, be a filthy piece of shit, and still find love. It's never over for you boys.
If Pow Envy is clapping cheeks, then you can too. Wow, I've seen it all. Don't lean over. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> uh, no, I... Does not smell very good. Fucking cheese, bro. <sighs> I don't know why. I poured some coke in it to try to make it smell better. Found my nail clippers too. Look how bad my nails get when I don't have nail uh, clippers and I use my fingers. It really hurts. I don't like it very much. Holy fuck. Anyway, bringing the dishes down. Got some trash bags filled up. Look at these coffees. Some of them look bad, some look good. I think it's based on how long they've been there. I'm gonna cry. This looks like syrup too. I don't know how I'm gonna get this out of the cup. I might have to throw it away. All right, let's see his Sigma Male Grindset Roblox Streamer morning routine. Morning routine as a Roblox streamer begins right as I wake up. I step out of bed and I jump on my computer so I can get onto my favorite game. Can you guess what it is? That's right. I get straight onto some Roblox, play a few games, eat some of my leftover breakfast from yesterday. The congealed it's the day cheese, after, I promise. bro. Drink some of my water that I've left out. It tastes the same. You can't even tell. I think this room is a set for him. He just continually adds to the filth. And like, maybe there's an understanding with his mom where it's like, yeah, this is just the fuck room. The fuck shit room. <laughs> this, this is, this is my swamp. I... That's, that's the only logical thing popping into my head, and it doesn't even make sense when I say it out loud. Because I cannot fathom this flying ever with an adult living under this roof. Then, I like to step out of my room, leave the domain as they say, head straight for the bathroom, brush my teeth, make my teeth sparkly Brush my white. roach. Then, if it's a Saturday, I'll shower. Yep. Every other day is a skip. Of course. My hair looks so good. Today is He's Saturday, on that no poo. As you can tell. Then I go take my daily Xanax for relaxation. Your what the trash now? is fine, doesn't need to be taken out. Your Pet Xanax? my beautiful cat because he's the best. I hate the blurred lines. I'm lost in the sauce. Hell yeah, we got a gym video. Let's see what absolutely cracked PRs Pow Envy is up to. I'm going to the gym so I can impress the ladies. As you can see, I'm starting off in a good place. I went ahead and went to my local gym place, and I got right to it. First off, I had 45 pound weights on this, and I wasn't able to lift them up. No matter how hard I tried, they wouldn't even budge. So I decided maybe this wasn't for me. I tried out the bar, and my friend told me this is usually where people start off. So I went for How is this guy more like XQC than XQC himself? For it. Now... This really hurt my back, and I don't know how I'm supposed to lift this. I think I have to work my way up a different way. It really hurt, and I couldn't really sit straight after that. So I just went ahead and got on this little bike thing, played some Clash of Clans on it. Um, but like I said, as the other ones, it just didn't feel very good. Made my heart kind of hurt. So my review of the gym, guys, is this. I need to see a Pow Envy X Sam Sullick collab right now. I want to see this kid on trend. And by the way, if he does any more cardio, he's going to disenchant himself. He's got to be like 96 pounds soaking wet. That means if he eats a one pound burrito, he is more than 1% burrito. All of this for 6,000 subscribers on YouTube. Look, at the end of the day, maybe some of his jokes are satire. But you know what's not a joke? Every time he turns off his camera, he is sitting in filth. If you've made it this far, you truly are some of my strongest warriors. I'm about to introduce you to the Ohio Cockroach Giat song. So hey, let's be Riz. I'm dying to see your big yat. Grab your toilet, it's gibbity. I can make the Rizzler yat for Ohio. So it's gonna be a no. Rizzler. Uh, or it's gonna go skip it. No! And you love the gas. Cause the Sigma Ever Alpha will riz our neighbor's dog. It'll leave you beta. Uh, or with a nasty cat. Got him on with the Vexky app. He'll tell you 